Good evening. I am Dr. Ken Lally with Teonji National University International. And my office is the office of the International President. Our lesson today is going to be Prepare to Meet Thy God, Amos 4 12. I'm going to read 11 with 12. I have overthrown some of you as God overthrew Sodom and Gomorrah. And ye were as a firebrand plucked out of the burning. Yet have ye not returned unto me, saith the Lord. Therefore thus will I do unto thee, O Israel. And because I will do this unto thee, prepare to meet thy God, O Israel. Telephone. Ignore it. I'll have to turn it off when I do these things. Israel was not prepared to meet their God. Last week I could have died. During this past year, I have been in the hospital five times. I could have died any time. Am I ready to meet my God? Are you ready to meet yours? John 14, 1, 2, and 3. I go to prepare a place. I will come again. In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself, that where I am, there you may be also. Matthew 25, 34. Inherit the kingdom prepared. Then shall the king say unto them on his right hand, Come, you blessed of my father, inherit the kingdom prepared for you from the foundation of the world. Hebrews eleven seven. Noah prepared an ark and saved his house. Have you prepared yourself your house for salvation? By faith Noah, being warned of God of things not seen as yet, moved with fear, prepared an ark to the saving of his house, by the which he also condemned the world and became heir to the righteousness which is by faith. Have you prepared an ark for you and your family and friends? Mark fourteen twelve. Prepare the Passover for killing. And the first day of unleavened bread, when they killed the Passover, his disciples said to him, Where wilt thou that we go and prepare that thou mayest eat the Passover? He arose. On the third day. Joshua 1.11 Prepare to move in three days. Pass through the host and command the people, saying, Prepare ye victuals, for within three days ye shall pass over this Jordan to go in to possess the land which the Lord your God giveth you to possess it. Are you prepared to move? Is your house in order? 1 Samuel 7, 3, Prepare your heart to serve. And Samuel spake unto all the house of Israel, saying, If ye do return unto the Lord with all your hearts, then put away the strange gods and Ashtaroth from among you, and prepare your hearts unto the Lord, and serve him only, and he will deliver you out of the hand of the Philistines. Is your heart a heart of service, and are you prepared to serve? Ezra seven ten. Are you prepared in your heart to teach? For Ezra had prepared his heart to seek the law of the Lord and to do it and to teach in Israel statutes and judgments. Are you prepared to teach? Do you know how to prepare to teach? Can you teach? Isaiah 50 verse 4. This is my verse for my life. The Lord God hath given me the tongue of the learned, that I should know how to speak a word in season to him that is weary. He waketh morning by morning. He waketh mine ear to hear as the learned. I'm learned. If you have a question about what God has to say, I most likely can give you an answer. Ezekiel 4.15, prepare bread with dough. 
Israel is, is, is done. God has had it. And Ezekiel's the prophet. And he tells Ezekiel to, in the sight of Israel, prepare some bread and mix it with dung. That should taste good. Ezekiel 12, 3, prepare things to move into captivity. And he says, set up a table and prepare things for moving on the table. And then start digging through the wall and take your sack of stuff and escape through the wall. Are you prepared for moving? Are you prepared for dung? Are you prepared for captivity? 1 Chronicles 22, 5. David prepared before he died to build God's house. And Daniel said, Solomon, my son, is young and tender, and the house that is to be builded for the Lord must be exceeding magnificent of fame and of glory throughout all the countries. I will therefore now make preparation for it. So David prepared abundantly before his death. What are you doing to prepare the building of God's house while you're here and after you're gone? Isaiah 40, verse 3. Prepare the way. The voice of him that crieth in the wilderness, prepare ye the way of the Lord, make straight in the desert a highway for our God. With Malachi 3 1, the messenger, prepare my way. Behold, I will send my messenger, and he shall prepare the way before me, and the Lord whom ye seek shall suddenly come into his temple, even the messenger of the covenant whom ye delight in. Behold, he shall come, saith the Lord of hosts. Jesus was coming. They weren't ready. Jesus is coming again. Are you ready? Corresponding verses are Matthew 3.3 3 and Matthew 11.10 where Jesus says these two passages were fulfilled. The way was prepared for Jesus. He made a way for you. Psalm 23 verse 5. Thou preparest a table before me. Jesus prepared He's preparing a building for you in glory. Are you prepared to meet God?